the internet might not necessarily be the best thing for parkour. Controversial topic, yeah, but personally, I think Instagram is killing the sport. Oh, really? Okay, here we go. Let's talk about it. Why is Instagram killing the sport of parkour? And so effectively, like, for example, I want to put in, I'd put in like four or five hours work to, to get this perfect line absolutely bang on. That gets 200 views and no light. I then go all fucking about my mates and I do like, I've got a clip on, on my TikTok. I've got a TikTok now because I'm down with the kids. So I've got a, a video on there, which is viral. It has 20 million views and it's a case of I'm holding on to a bar. I swing forward. I can't leap onto a little electric post with tiny little finger moves in it. That were not even something I was going to film. That's viral. That's what people see. It's like, why? It's just stupid. But even though that went viral, two days later, no one knows. No one cares. It's forgotten about. So Don Tomato, first person to do the confront down in London to this little silly ledge thing. That was an amazing, wow, oh my God, world's first. It, the world went crazy for a day. And it was forgotten. Because it was flooded by all the other Instagram clips. It, you can't go the same kind of viral anymore. There's too much. Like Instagram is just flooding you with all these free second, like some good, some shit, make your own decision. But in the YouTube days, you saw like three minutes at least and you knew what was good to watch. Now, half a second, scroll, scroll. You, you don't even know what you've just watched. You've just been bombarded with it. Yeah, there's, there's, like, uh, there's like so much content. Back in the day, GUP would come up with a video. Oh my gosh, GUP dropped a new video. Everyone goes and watches it. It's mind blowing. Maybe you watch it a couple of times. And the silly videos, Capstone released videos. Everyone gets crazy. You've got your big yeah. project like Motors used to the, the close down now, unfortunately. But Motors were a company that, not a company, a parkour team that did big videos, pay per view videos, an hour long, and you loved it. And that stuck with us. But like, Instagram's just an half a second. It's it's not the same to, to me anyway. I waste way too much time on it, and I, I don't take. There's no takeaway. There's no like. I look at him like, okay, I'll cool. Yeah, that'll cool. It was too much. Like I know I keep repeating myself now, but I'm just yeah. It's just it it does matter. It? When is the last time Store launched a big project? You know, they had Roof Culture, they had Super Tramps, and then when's the last time they did something big? Uh, the Wall Run competition that was their last big thing wasn't it that was a, a community event rather than a video and they made video art but maybe they got out of traveling and sleeping in hammocks or something <laughs> they got old and boring <laughs> yeah 